The old man remembers the Shalebridge fires. Flames so bright, night became day. Or was it smoke so thick, day became night? Well, I read that before the Baron was born, the city was at war. Read it, did you? Oh, la de friggin' da. Nothing like being there, is it? These streets have seen all manner of shit. Fires, plagues. Don't forget the war. <sighs> it was with Blackbrook, all right? More of a squabble than a war. Of course, if our neighbors catch wind of the shit pile we're in now, you'll see your bloody war. This? Watch Alley. I'll need to step lightly. Something happens, all right? Wonder if the Baron can do something to stop the sickness from spreading. Word goes, we're getting orders to off anyone who shares lodging with a gloomer. House by house. What? Well, that's serious business. Shit, would, uh, would we get more coin? So there's a spreading sickness. The gloom. You're kidding! I swear. Oh, please, sir. Please, sir. You could smell that <laughs> shit himself. <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. Captain's orders. He said go stand under the window of that woman on Bleach Market. Her with the face that the rakers would throw back in the river. <laughs> Try to make it crack a smile. <laughs> Boss! Die of the gloom already! Do everyone a favor! Careful. She's off to fetch the piss pot. <laughs> I hope she dumps piss on your heads. It didn't improve your smell. Cry about martial law, but you don't see him leaving. We locked the gates, you fog skull. <laughs> Idiot. They say old what's his name's gone down with the gloom. Who? Bah. He had it coming. Chewing coffee beans. Bah. I'd kill for a cup. Barry should have given you his speeches about this lockdown business. People love fancy speeches. When was the last time anyone saw his face? Stop. Well, I can see what that's intended for. Shoot it and it'll drop on their heads. I'm gonna look for loot to steal. I don't see much. In fact, I don't see anything. You're from up Eastport Way, right? Is the gloom there yet? Yep. River drains were clogged with the drowned. It was ripe. Like a giant sloop. Hey, come on. I just ate some of that before shift started. I was the shit sop who stood waist deep in the stuff, carting them out. Seems as if we spend more time catching our breath instead of thieving lifters. That's why you want a nice patrol like this. Stone Market's not so bad. You pay no mind to the coughing and crying. Not so bad? <laughs> the sickness, the protests, this lockdown. Something's coming. I can feel it. Could be something up here. I'm starving. Maybe not. Oh, look at that. That's neat. Yeah, if you're walking and you walk up to something like this, he kind of peers over. Sweet. Maybe I can get on that pipe. Eh, probably not. There's not really a reason to. I guess I'm there. Completed. Opportunist. All right, here's a breakdown. Collectibles found two out of four. Wow, that's not that good. Loot found 43 out of 60. That's pretty damn good. Didn't kill anyone, of course. 
Suspicions raised four. Yeah, messed up quite a few times. Oh, I only extinguished six flames. So my main playstyle play is opportunist. Bit of ghost and a bit of predator. Alright, let's check out my crib. Collections display updated. Well, place could use, uh... Can I light this? No. Place could use a little bit of a dusting. God, I feel like I'm choking on the dust already. Looks wonderful. Looks like your mattress is turning into moss. Or maybe it's petrifying. This is where you sleep, Garrett. Star of Aldale necklace under... under what? Under bank protection. In the vault of Stone Market First Bank. The famous Star of Aldale necklace <laughs> is in the vault of the Stone Market First Bank. Well, I know where I want to go. Yes. I really love the sound design. It sounds so good. The footsteps, the creaks, the birds. Just, and the environmental detail is... This looks so good. It's a beautiful game. All the webs over everything. Foggy, dusty. Unique loot. F1 open journal. What? Oh. God, look at the way that just... Shines. It looks beautiful. It's the shiniest necklace I've ever seen in a game, probably. I'm not sure why it prompts for that when I look at this chest. I don't understand the connection. Can't seem to open it. Ah. So yeah, it's part of my collection, and open my journal, and I can look at it. Okay. Neat. Gonna be collecting a lot more. Oh yeah, another cutscene. Need Basso at the Crippled Burrick. I guess that's a level transition orb thing there. <laughs> I just love the, the lonely, ominous sound this place has. I wonder what it'd sound like with music. I wonder what kind of music they have here. Sounds like they have none. Alright, I don't think there's anything else to do here. That's weird, they've taken away the ability for me to sprint. This is the chest where I keep all my supplies. 
I should ready myself before I leave. <laughs> Here's Reggie Bull, my supplies. Nothing. Yay! Probably uh, need to visit a store for that. Yeah, for some reason I can't sprint in my own home. It's, my shift key is disabled. Weird. Alright, let's go. Stone Market, yes. Oh, that's where that bank is, isn't it? In Stone Market. <laughs> it's a passing thing, sir. I'm sure of it, not the gloom. In two days, send men to claim his property for the crest. <laughs> oh my god. Have them bring a car. God, poor guy. He might just have a cold. <laughs> Actually, can you imagine that? Anytime there's some sort of a huge infection, disease sweeping across a population, just imagine you're a person who just gets a cold. Can you imagine how scared that would make you? How scared it would make other people? How they might react to that? When you're first getting sick, maybe you don't know what it is. It could be a cold, maybe it's not. God, that'd be terrifying. Yeah, there's the crippled Burrick. <laughs> nice name, crippled Burrick. Let's see what the map looks like here. Oh, F1. Holy hell. Uh, it's big. Really big. There's really no reason to sneak up here. No one's gonna see me. Arrows can be used to break pulleys from a distance. Okay, let's use an arrow for the first time. What do I have? I think I have one... Yeah, I only have one normal arrow. Alright. And I have no reticles, so I better hit it correctly. Where's the pulley? It's that thing. Excellent. What if I don't want any? There we go. Put it away. Ten! North Crests, we've had ten. And this one's the worst of the lot. You can't blame him for the gloom. Oh, how about that his watch are thugs in uniforms? I don't know. You listen to him talk? He believed in what he was doing. Running this place takes a firm hand. He wanted to improve things. Aye, he's so proud of his improvements that him and his firm hand haven't crossed the river in a year. Like I said, worst of the lot. I'm trying not to be miserable. <coughs> really. I love the footstep sounds as you're walking across the tiles up here. Or the shingles. Whoa. The hell? Sounds like somebody just kicked in a door. So can I just go anywhere I want? Tyrant, you folk skull. Oh. Ooh. What's the tyrant? The painter got a week in the stocks, right? Go ask her yourself. It's cold out tonight. Let's see what's in here. Yeah, I'm not really sure how much freedom I have here. Well, that would appear to be a pressure plate, I think. It's a rather obvious pressure plate. Uh, what's it going to do if I hit it? Hmm. Ooh, there's a lock on this thing, okay.
priceless picture. Or a switch. I thought I was going to steal a priceless picture and put a price on it. This priceless picture is worth 20 gold. I'm no Secret. Uh, what the hell did that do? Oh no, I can't steal the priceless picture. What's it worth? It's worth five. Well, the frame's worth five. The picture itself is worth a thousand words. And a thousand words is worth, uh, twenty gold. According to the blue book. Oh god. Ah! Oh. Did it do nothing because I disabled it, or, or what? I, I forgot that when I uh, went to open the drawer, it wouldn't just open it, it would actually move me in front of it. What would that do? I guess I disabled it. Yeah, I guess that's all I switched did. There's really nothing else here that could have possibly done. Oh, whoa. Wait a minute, there's one there. Yep. Yep, there's one there. Oh, when did I last save it? Well, it's before I did the whole thing. Whoops. Super fast. Pick this lock. I know there's no one in there, so I can... Don't have to be too careful. Now I know. Look out for pressure plates. It's cold out tonight. Alright, so it looks like it's set to not activate. Yeah, it's deactivated. So what activates it? It's just, is it hitting the switch that activates it, or is it when you hit the other pressure plate? I'm really curious now, how they've rigged it up. Yep, didn't activate that one, so let's see. Okay, yeah, this activates that one, okay. So then what does that switch actually do? I think a tooth's coming loose. I guess it just opens this up. Because that was closed before. Okay. It's a rather strange setup in there. Doesn't seem like what they were protecting was really worth all that setup. I guess I should just go to the Burrick. Yeah. Don't want to get too sidetracked. I do want to do side missions and stuff, though. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Seriously? You get what? You can't make that. So again, the game does allow you to... Uh, it allows you to jump wherever they tell you you can jump, but they even allow you to jump at places where you actually can't. I need to sleep. You can't make it. In this case, I can't make that. I feel like I can make that. Maybe not get my feet on there, but I feel like I could at least grab it with my hands. I was even sprinting, but all right. Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. I can put a rope arrow there, can't I? Do I have a rope arrow? I don't. Doesn't matter. That piss they sell might wash the taste of sloop from my mouth. What the hell is sloop? Must be something nasty if piss tastes better than it, though. Ew. Is there like fish residue on this table? Why are there so many flies? Ooh. Look, 
like lockers. <laughs> There's actually physics on these things. It's cool. Is there anyone in here? Doesn't look like it. Yeah, this place is empty. New instructions. Regarding the reports from your quacks on handling of the gloom situation, I propose that you draft a new report based on the following guidelines. I want to encourage a steady flow of gloomers through the works for processing. What the hell does that mean? Processing? Mm-hmm. Wait a minute. This is from the Thief Taker General. It's a strange position. Hmm. I love desks with this many drawers. It's a dream come true. Lockdown. Watch report. Another hard one. Baron's bust. Busty. Now what did I get? Watch report. Wow, that's a <laughs> that's a really short report. Watch guard Munion. Weapon store six C move to the Black Alley stash. Alright, weapon store in the Black Alley stash. No idea where the Black Alley is. But if I find it, I'll keep that in mind. Oh god, I gotta do this again to get out. Clock Tower Plaza. You know what I miss? The sound of horse food. Now you're talking. <laughs> Been months since I've had a bowl of horse meat sleep. It sounds like Sloop is slop. Hi. Oh, there's a transition. I'm just, I'm hoping that going into here isn't gonna like prevent me from doing all the side stuff. <laughs> You know, start some sort of a quest I can't get back from. I'm going to assume it won't. <sighs> I would have went for the pickle jar, but I saw a lot more weight. <laughs> So you still can't work a door. You don't come to see me, you don't write. <laughs> I thought both you and Aaron had been killed in the mansion attack. Where the hell?
hell have you been? I don't know. You don't know? <laughs> Fine. Forget it. Far be it for me to pry about where you've been for the last fucking year. <coughs> I don't have time for this. <sighs> Especially with the Baron's new duty on opium, thanks to this gloom sickness. Not to mention the Thief Taker General's black tax. Squeezing us, entrepreneurs. If you got a job for me, let's hear it. <laughs> Are you sure you're up to it? Okay, so, here's the gig. <laughs> I need you to obtain a ring for me. Getting married? <laughs> Never again. <coughs> ah, you mangy bird. I swear one day I'm gonna have you made into a hat. And lose the brains of the uh, outfit. <laughs> I'm running out of fingers. <laughs> Good job, Basil. Good yeah, job. yeah, 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 right. Uh, belongs to a guy named uh, Cornelius Greaves, one of those hoity-toity types who doesn't have any shit on his boots. Ah, ah. here you go. What's the catch? Eh, uh, he's dead. I'm a thief, Basso, not a grave robber. Only recently deceased. My sources say he never took the ring off. Doesn't seem much of a challenge. Ah, challenge. We'll be getting to him before the Carters pick him over. Rumor has it they've been taking bodies to that old, uh, foundry near Cinderfall. Crawling with the Baron's guards for some reason. Now, the best way to that place is through the old chapel. <laughs> and, uh, don't screw this up, Garrett. Some of us still need to pay our dues. You can't tax what you can't catch. <laughs> Get out of here. And you use the door? Please? Still, it's good to see you. Huh. I should get more sleep. <laughs> the first thing I hear is I should get more sleep from some random NPC. Okay, Basso. Basso often has side jobs to complete. Check with him regularly to see regularly to see what he has lined up. I have something. Hear that, friends? It's the crows. A whole matter of them. Stock up on supplies at the shady merchant. They're singing the tale of Baron Northcrest. The tapper who locked us in this iron cage, all in the name of progress. Hold iron. <sighs> if you're looking for extra oh, coin, I have some jobs you can help me what with. What the hell is wrong with the audio? <laughs> it's like doubled up and coming through the left channel, and it was really quiet too. Oh my god, there's five jobs available. Sick Willy. Uh, I can make quite a few euphemisms from that. To do, Garrett, over a pint. <laughs> Maybe I'll even Eight buy the first round. The trade. Please don't tell me you're going to keep talking while I'm looking over the quests. Please don't. Please don't do that. Don't do the same thing Thief Deadly Shadows did. Oh my god, they did it. The wine, Fuck the you. Fuck you. Shit. Fuck you. That's the I hated that so much in Thief Deadly Shadows. I'd be talking to the merchant guy trying to sell my stuff, and then he'd just keep saying stuff every five seconds. Mm. We make a good team, Garrett. You with the stealing, me with the charm. I guess I should just take everything, right? I mean, is there any anything bad to taking everything? Medication bottles. I know Pinchcock claims she's the Baron's mistress. Tries to charge a full gold piece for her stories. <laughs> All right, I don't, I'm not sure what accept and track is, and how that's different from just accept. I guess I can just manually track it if I want to. You're like a challenge, do yeah. you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just yeah. the job I would have picked. Yeah. Easy gold for a lifter like yeah. you. Yep. You'll handle that no please shut problem. up. I love you, but please shut up. Goodbye. Try not to get okay. We can only rely on ourselves to make things better. I'm starving. Hi, Basso. Don't mean to be creepy, but I'm staring in your window. This weather doesn't half make my Same leg ache. 
Now, one thing I'm wondering is, these aren't guards, these are civilians, so do they mind if they see me? Let's find out. Hi. Okay, so they don't care. Something feels wrong? What do you mean? The Basso family name's good as gold in these parts. Well, better than mud, at least. I wonder what they put in the sloop. Alright, so there's lots of transitions. Where does this go? I wonder if my map says where this goes. I still need to get familiar with this system. Yeah, the map system is frankly kind of crappy. You can't highlight stuff with your mouse. You have to move the screen, the center of the screen to what you want to highlight to look at what it actually is. So there's the Queen of Beggars. I guess I should just, well, go to the Queen of Beggars. Since she's right there. I'm assuming you're cool too. You're cool. You to get some nice I have something, something for all your nefarious needs. Uh, you're not the queen of beggars. I'll come back to you. Nothing catches your interest. That's too bad. Wait, you weren't the queen of beggars, right? Just to be sure. You don't look like the queen of beggars. It's not even... Oh, there we go. Shop. Okay, it's just a generic shop. you love this. The Blacktops tried to evict Mortimer. Now there's a job I wouldn't take. Of course, he went off on them, so they beat the tallow out of him. Need something? Well, he had it coming. And then they pitched him in a cart. He wasn't even dead. Blackhands wise and lift her prices. This is uh, kind of awkward. Do you think he'd notice if I pinched out the candles next to him? Saw one talking to himself by the clock tower. That's how it started with the upstairs neighbors. How'd it finish then? I came to the barrack and didn't go back. Glad I don't have a sister. I get the feeling she wouldn't last two seconds without going all so doe eyes. Aw, those are barracks, aren't they? They look so sad. Maybe it's because they're dead and they've been turned into plaques. That'd make me sad too. Yeah, so I guess they just divided the city into loading screens for memory issues or whatnot. God, I wish there was just a button that just took you straight to the map. Anyway, I think this is where I need to go for the Queen of Beggars. Yeah, there she is. How you doing this fine night? Looks, uh... Stormy. But yeah, just look at these shadows. They're so good. Look at that. Can make, like, hand puppets. I'm coming for you. Ugh. Zombie Garrett. Ugh. Brains. There's really not too much to worry about here. Yeah, these are just civilians, no guards. What the hell? He didn't just light it, he made wood appear. You're a very special person. Special powers. Maybe he's been touched by the gloom as well, or whatever the hell I've been touched by. Alright, where is she? Further, yeah, further along. Graveyard. That's the last of them. There'll be more tomorrow. I'm starting to think they're the lucky ones. Lucky, eh? Some of these gloomers bite off their tongues to make it stop. 
Some push in their eyes or their ears. Luck wants nothing to do with this city. Don't actually know if they'll report me. Also, didn't I pass her? Oh. It's not telling me where she is. It's telling me I need to go here, and then I need to go here, and then I need to go here. Okay. Gotcha. But yeah, I heard one of the problems this game has is that it's hard to tell who actually wants to kill you. Like, these guys, they're not guards. Would they freak out if they saw me? And the answer is no. Yeah, piles of bodies. Not a pleasant sight. The old chapel on Morningside. The court of the Queen of Beggars. Oops, she's somewhere in there. What's around here? Nothing. There's an invisible wall. Here. Got to go around it. Weird. No old gods for the new city. I don't think there's anything to steal around here. No, let's just go see her. Looks like there's yet another transition. It's a lonely night. It's the best kind. Mm. Uh, Garrett, you walk a path few would wish. That's the only one I know. Quite. You know what they say about me? That you know everything that happens in this city. Not everything. Just the important things. What brings you here? Seeking my counsel? A year ago, I was at the Northcrest Mansion. Something went wrong. What happened to me? What happened to Aaron? A year ago. Men who believed themselves to know best try to control something they didn't fully understand for their own ends. The balance has shifted. We can all feel it. That's your answer. When my beggars found you, after the accident, they thought you were dead. But you were not dead. So we healed your broken body, and brought you from the city to... to keep you safe, while we waited. But then... Just after the gloom started, something began to wake you. It was time for you to return home. This city grows sick. It will tell you all in time, if you choose to listen. Careful, Garrett. There are worse things in the shadows than you. Oh my god, the writing. Oh, the writing. Earning focus points. Donate gold to the Queen of Beggars to receive focus points. Enhance my focus abilities. I don't even use focus, so I don't care. I guess I'm going to spend it on items instead. Go to the old foundry. And why do I want to do it? Why is there an invisible wall here? What the hell? Look at this. I'm walking forwards right now. What the... 
Uh, I can swoop through it, but I can't walk. Okay. Wrench tool. Wait, if I have a wrench, I can just, like, take this plaque? Okay, where do I buy a wrench? I need one now. Also, I thought she sold stuff. Can I only donate to her? Alright, so what's my objectives? Go to the old foundry. Oh, it's up there. Get to the bank. That's right, over there. Okay, just getting a feel for the map. Do, do, do. I kind of want to go do all those quests, but then again, I'm here. Should probably do this while I'm here. Alright, let's see where this goes. Oh, that starts chapter two. Hmm. Never mind. It's starting a new chapter. Let's go back and let's do these quests. And let's buy some stuff from the shop. As that man is so generically called. Oh, come on, Garrett. You can sprint for more than five seconds. You got for me, my friend. You won't find items like these in many places. Okay. Broadhead arrows. Uh, only need them for like shooting bridges and stuff. I don't need fire arrows. Water arrows are good. I've already got two. That's fine. Choke arrow. Oh, noxious and suffocating gas. Okay, so that's like the gas arrows from the Thief series, I guess. Rope arrow I absolutely need. Let's go ahead and buy two. Blunt. Brakes on impact. Oh, it's designed to interact with the environment at a distance without wasting more expensive options. Okay, so this is what you want to use for getting bridges down and stuff. Okay. Let's buy a bunch of those. They're cheap. In fact, I'm... Yeah, I'll just get ten. Flashball. Could be useful for getting away. I kind of just want to avoid being seen in the first place, though. Restores focus. Don't care. Food. Already got it. Oh, this is to sell. Sell. Buy tools and upgrade. Ooh. Ooh. What is this stuff? Lockpick quality. Slightly increases lockpicking sensitivity. Hmm. Can't afford that stuff, but that would be nice. I really want that tool, though. The... Whatever it was. Wrench would be good, though. Was it the wrench? I don't think it was the wrench. Something else. <sighs> Lucky coin. Increases maximum focus. Don't care. Grinning salt increases the health benefits of eating food. Hmm. Moss quiver. Broadhead and sawtooth arrows produce no sound on impact. That just made me realize there's no moss arrows, are there? Aww. Those were awesome. Reduces damage taken from burning and traps. Reduces the chance of being hit by enemy projectiles. Alright, well I got a bit of money. Let's spend it on lockpicks. Improved. He's sold out of... improvements. Whatever that means. I'm always open. Ooh. I like how that sounds. I need a drink. You'll love this. The Blacktops tried to evict Mortimer. Now there's a job I another wouldn't night, take. Another night, another gloomer. He went off so I wouldn't talk to himself the by the clock tower. Well, that's how it's coming. Yeah, I'm pretty sure those are guards in there, so I'm just gonna leave. He wasn't even dead. I came to the barrack. didn't go back. Black so what's the next mission to do? Uh, let me figure that out in just a second. I'll be right back. Okay. So looking through the quests, and I think I'm gonna do this one first. Steal the Thief Manuscript. 
Turns out one of my clients was a wordsman, an author. He's written a book about the so-called filthy underbelly of the city, starring yours truly. Find him and make sure his manuscript never sees the light of day. So that's right here, pretty close. Yeah, let's do it. It's pretty much straight where I'm going. Okay. Should be easy enough to find. So just keep going this way, right? Yeah. It's getting late. Try to make a perma save as well. I haven't done that for a long time. Yeah. Oh no, it is the wrench I need. Okay. Yeah. Need the wrench to take that. This gloom is everywhere. Maybe I should have saved up my money for that, but after doing all of these quests, I think I'm gonna have plenty of money. Oh god, I'm actually in the light. Shit. Whew. What is that? Oh, that's a transition, isn't it? Yeah, that glowing thing up there. It's gotta be. Alright, I think it's right about here. Yeah. I think I might need to go up. Oh, I think he made a pun. These modern lights are giving me a headache. Look on the bright side. You get it? Yeah. E e e e open. Dump the dead here and leave them to rot. Author's apartment. All right, definitely in the right place. I'm guessing the author is most likely home. Otherwise, it wouldn't be much tension, I suppose. This book is going to be my big break. I can just feel it. But, my dear fellow, who ever did you find to publish such a tawdry romanticization of the life of a common thug? Clock Tower Bookbinders, over at the plaza, they said it was exactly the kind of book that would draw the watch's attention. Do you think I should have asked for a bigger advance? Undoubtedly. Alright, so they're beneath me. Literally and figuratively, they're beneath me. Disgusting. God, this place is dirty. Jesus. It's covered in flies. Wait a minute. How do I... I can't get downstairs. Or maybe they're above me, or... I, I don't know. I'll figure it out in a second. In the meantime, let's steal stuff. The gold picture frame. Yeah, I think they might be above me. Looking at that. Question is, how do I get up? Lock. You want to fill our cells with gloomers? Great idea, sloop for brains. <laughs> it doesn't appear I can. It's weird. Is it author's apartment? But. It's like this is a totally separate place. Unless I'm missing something. I don't think so. 
guess I gotta go up more. Unless there's like a secret switch now. Okay, how the hell do I get in this place? Yoink. This is the place, right? Wait. Did, <laughs> did I complete the quest? I'm, I'm super confused. No, what? Oh, god damn it, that's right, the fuck. It doesn't actually show you where it is, it shows you where to go next. They're expecting you to have the waypoint markers on. How helpful. Okay, it's over there. It's behind me. Directly behind me. Huh? <laughs> Bookbinder over there. <laughs> I went the wrong way. Hold on, is there another way I can go? I kind of want to explore over here. Where does this go? Chapel? The clock tower. Oh, right, back home. Weird place to put a golden ashtray, but I'll take it. Okay, now I've totally lost my sense of. Oh no, it's over there. Yeah. Oh god. Oh, whew. Let me jump down too far. God, the lighting is so good. Look at that. I'm guessing that's probably it. Yeah. Question is, how do I get in? And the answer is, not through the front. Look at how brightly lit that closet is. It's like it's just inviting me to enter it. I will resist. What the hell? Oh, I think it might have actually made them suspicious. You taking the officer's exam? <laughs> Not a chance. The men hate the captains even more than the commons hate us. Ragbag called me a taffer. What's that mean? I don't know. Something bad. Seeing as he spit on me, you I'm just saying. You make a show of the old fool? Nah, he only got a few kicks in before his heart gave out. Spoiled my fun. I'm not actually sure how to enter that place. Well, it looks like there's an alleyway back there. Is there? I don't... 
Oh, I guess it's right there. Here we go. Hold E to watch your avatar move about. Press E to make him do stuff. And then wait again. There we go. One of our secret switches. I thought he was going to press it for a second. I was like, oh my god, Garrett, don't press it! You're going to make noise! But he stole it, which is a little bit more sensible. Ooh, secret switch. I think that's a secret switch. Before that, though, let's test out my fancy new lockpicks. I think it makes them more sensitive, so there's probably a larger area where it's... Where you can press E. Yeah, that's my guess. Binders register. Hmm. Mechanical hammer and other short stories. <laughs> the mechanical hammer and other short stories. The mechanical hammer does not sound like a good short story. Sounds pretty boring. Shy away from infamy. He used to wear it like his bad perfume. Laid on thick. Excellent. Done with that. I'm assuming I have to take it back to him, right? Or no? Oh, I guess it's done automatically. Yeah. Apparently I don't have to take it back. It's kind of a relief, I suppose. Not sure it makes much sense since I didn't actually give him the book, but I'll take it. Don't tell me I have to move that thing again, do I? Oh my god, I do. Oh. Okay, what's next? Let's do Medical Misery. Let's see what the hell Medical Misery actually is. Steal the medication bottle. There's word of yet another miracle gloom tonic on the street, but this one's meant to be based on actual medicine. Dr. Troy claims to have brewed a remedy, but he's keeping it locked up in his shop. Get your hands on the sample and we could find ourselves rolling in coin. All in the valiant name of curing the sick. Cool. That's down this way. Ooh, wait a minute. That guy's got a purse, uh, but that guy's watching. The gullet. Ew. Damn, look at the size of those tools. Really? He, he tries to peek around the table, but he can't quite do it. Come on, Garrett, what's wrong with you? Do it. Is it because the bucket's in the way? There, kick it. There we go, the bucket was in the way. Ector's Emporium. Sounds fancy. 
Sounds like it's full of loot. Oh, shit. Oh. Uh. I guess I'm not hiding. Hi. Oh my god, look at that. That looks so cool. Don't worry. Hector, I presume. Is that you? The master thief? Who's your friend? That's my metal man right there. My life's work. All clockwork and machinery. He could revolutionize the city. Get me the recognition I deserve. If it weren't for that damned Baron. The Baron's a damn fool. He grew impatient. Ordered me to destroy the project. But I couldn't pull apart my metal man, could I? The job, Hector. What do you need? My friend here is almost whole. Problem is, I've been stabbed in the back by the very scum I hired to build him. One jealous lout even stole my metal man's mechanical hand. And you want it back. Exactly. Ah, so it's a hand Alfonso, job. Okay. The weaselly tailor of Stone Market has stashed the hand in his shop. Recover the device, and I'll pay you for your trouble. Hand tailored. Oh, it, sh it totally should have been called hand job. Like the hand job. It would have been perfect. Alfonso's tailor isn't steal a mechanical hand he says belongs to him. It's a simple question. My metal man needs you. Something feels odd about this whole affair, but the loot sounds interesting. Are you sure you want to start this client's job? Why is why is it asking me if I'm sure? Don't make me beg, please. My groveling days are behind me. Does it like change the course of something or other? Sure, whatever, I'll take it. Finally, someone who recognizes the importance of my work. Check out Alfonso's attire at Stone Market. That weasel's no doubt stashed my metal hand in his tailor shop. Okay, did I... Am I actually completing the right quest, or am I doing a different one? I guess I just did a different one. Okay, cool. Uh, do you sell stuff? Hello there. Check out Alfonso's attire and stone. Yes, yes, thank you. Skip, that skip, skip. Load. Whoa, look at that. Wait, can I just steal his stuff? Uh, does he mind? He doesn't care at all. I'm stealing his personal letters. Something. Hector isn't the brains behind this operation. I'll play along. At least until I've been paid. Sounds good to me. Now what did I just collect? I guess I should probably read this if I want to figure out what's going on. Mr. Rothschild, you're treading on thin ice, Hector. I want to assist you your new endeavor. The heart is the product of my innovation. If anything, I should inform the engineer of your dreadful plot to commandeer the automaton project. Huh. If I hear any further discussion of this, I swear I'll take every action to stop you. From the desk of Luther Clockwise. <laughs> Clockwise. Beautiful name for someone who I'm assuming is some sort of engineer. Oh my god. Hector seems mad. Stop ignoring my letters. I know you've locked up in your house and I have the metal man's heart. Okay, so it looks like Hector might be crazy. Memoirs, page 1218. Ooh, boy. That's a big one. I finally completed my automaton after months of solitary hardship. Hmm. Mm-hmm. End of volume... That's the end of volume one is on page 1,218. A profane sketch of Alfonso, clockwise, and Baron Northcrest fills the margin of the final page. <laughs> right, so Hector's crazy. Manuscript. This damned city. Oh, yes, that's the one about... Uh, About the guy? Apparently it's not. Eh, whatever. Newspapers. Fascinating. Okay, now how do I get to where I actually need to go? Medical mystery. It's right there. 
Hmm. Maybe I go this way. Oh, I can go in there. Can I also go up here? Yes. Okay, can someone tell me why when you're going through these... Going through these, there's always a big pillar you have to push out of the way? What the hell is up with that? That... weird. That's just weird. A real man provides for his family. A real man wouldn't let us starve. Oh? And what would you have me do? The Baron's watch is hiring. They must pay better than begging on the street. That's great. Just great. All I have to give up is my common decency. I'm getting sick. I know it. Oh, wait a minute. I don't have the right tool to enter this place, do I? Oh, shit. Yeah, I think I need the wrench. Alright. Gotta save up for the wrench. That's gotta be my next thing. What's up here? Uh, why is this door made for someone four feet tall? Strange. Hmm. What might be in here? Uh, apparently there's a loading screen in there. this doctor's brewing something better than the other shit sop remedies people are selling? Let me ask you this. Would you buy a remedy from a man who's gone and caught the gloom himself? What Marco said... Let me tell you what Marco said. Blah, blah, blah. I pretend I know things and only idiots believe me. He does kind of sound like that, doesn't he? Right. Okay, maybe I didn't need the tool. It just would have been a the easier way in, I guess. Because I think this is the right place. Be quite the coincidence if it wasn't. Probably shouldn't open that since they're right inside of there, but I'll leave it unlocked just in case. Dr. Troy's surgery. Let's say bone setter and druggist. <laughs> He's a druggist. That just doesn't sound good, does it? Is there any way in there? Without being seen? There's two freaking guards. That's the way in, isn't it? Yep. Don't have the tool. There's a Troy tonic for every ailment that they don't come cheap. Little wonder he can afford guards. Looks to be safe. to be proportional to the amount of saliva, otherwise, poof, not good, uh -huh. not good at all. He's probably going to notice the door is open, right? But I can't, I can't put out that light. Wait, no, that's not right. Not a torch, there's, there's a switch right there. Oh, shit. Ah, if I put it out, he's going to start moving. Have to stay awake. He's going to notice. Stay sane, I have to work. Please, the amount please of work. has to be proportional to the amount of saliva, otherwise, poof, not good, not good. Uh -huh. I'm not entirely sure what to do. I can't knock him out. Wait. No, that's not right. Since I'm playing on master mode, maybe... Uh, I guess I should just turn off the light? I have to hurry. I have to stay awake. Stay sane. I have to work. Please. 
Please the work. Of has to be proportional to the amount of saliva, otherwise, poof, not good, not good at all. And let's leave. I just need him to move somewhere else. Is there anyone there? In the shadows, perhaps? No, 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 no. Why would there be someone in the shadows? After all, I suppose. He's just gonna turn it on again, right? Yeah, oh right. god. No, that's not right. I have to hurry. I have to stay awake. Stay sane. I have to work. Please, please the work. Of has to be proportional to the I don't even have like a knockout arrow, and I'm pretty sure I couldn't use that anyway. Shit. Wait. No, that's not right. All right, let me get a look at this place. I have to hurry. I have to stay awake. Stay sane. I can look for a couple seconds before he turns around. Please work. Okay, hide in the shadows. Okay, making progress. I don't know why he hasn't noticed the door's open, but I'm very glad he hasn't. Wait, no, that's not right. I have to hurry. Have to stay awake. Stay sane. Does I go to the guard room? Yeah. Okay, so where is what I need? No, that's not right. I have to hurry. Have to stay awake. I don't even see it. I'm assuming it's on the table, but I don't specifically see it. Okay, that's money, but it's not what I need. You know what? I think I need to distract him. I just remembered I have bottles. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, qu question is, are all the guards gonna hear it too? We're about to find out. Fuck, I think they did. Please don't go through this door. If there is a thief here, you do not belong. Get in the closet. It's not here. Shit. Where is it? And how do I get out of here now? Oh, I think I fucked myself. I think I fucked myself hard. I can't even see where he is. Where are you? Alright, let's just go. Well, that didn't work. Hi. Uh, I don't think I want to stay where I am. So where is it? Yeah, let's dodge. Alright, so where is this thing? Now that I actually have freedom of movement, where is it? Oh no, don't pick the lock. Don't pick the lock. Oh god. Well, I'm dead. He's yours. Is that it? Okay, that's it. Alright, I can get it. Let's just turn this light on and load. <laughs> so there it is, a nondescript like black bottle. The one thing I didn't pick up. Hey. What the fuck? Stay where you are. Why is my save game there? Well, that's not hey. good. That is really not Stay good. Where you are. Okay, I guess I saved right after I uh, picked it up. Great. He don't run away.
know what? You better open that really fast, Garrett. Thank you. I think I'm safe. Okay, learned a couple things there. Yep, yep, yep. Let's, uh... Let's go ahead and eat. Apparently I can't select the food on the scroll bar here. I have to press H. Okay. Let me check something really quick in the game and HUD. That's weird, the ammo counter is set to timed fade. Which means it should fade out when you don't need it, but for some reason the ammo counter in the bottom right is, seems to be staying up. I don't really know why. Oh, that doesn't mean it fades out completely, it just means it partially fades out, I think? I don't know. It's fine. I'm getting sick. I know it. Okay, what next? Alfonso's attire. Seems pretty close. Yeah, let's do that. Oh wait, no. That's the wrong one. This one. Right behind me. This way. Hmm, there appears to be a wall in my way, which is rather unfortunate. 